my channel. So for today's video, I'm gonna show you guys the things that I got from my Paris trip. I also went in Lavalie Village outlet. I'm not sure if I pronounce it correctly. I scored some um, great items uh, for myself and also as a gift for my family. And I'm gonna show you today some of the items that I got personally for myself. So yeah, let's start with um, this Kenzo items that I got. So Kenzo is actually one of the famous brands in um, in Paris, which is available in Lavalie Outlet Village. So I got this classic shirt. Let me show it to you guys. Okay. So it's really, really good to shop in Paris because aside from getting a good price, um, you'll also get a tax refund. So for tax refund, you have to purchase a minimum of um, 100 euros, if I'm not mistaken, 100 euros, and then you'll get the tax refund of 12%. So yeah, I got this classic Kenzo shirt. The old price is 150 euro and I only got it for 105 euro. Yeah, let me show you. Mm -hmm. Another Kenzo shirt. Let's open it. This is one of the new styles also that they have. So a lot of people said that um, the items that they have in the outlet are um, from the previous collection or from the previous season. But um, in the lovely outlet village, I was actually amazed about the line of products that we have, that they have. Um, it's actually pretty good. I mean, um, these items are not that much outdated. So yeah, second item that we got is also another Kenzo. It has this style on the side it's an oversized shirt actually the original price is 115 euros and i got it only for 80 euros i got these two shirts from kenzo for like around 180 euros less than 12 percent tax so it's really really a good buy There's a lot of people who's actually asking me how to go to lovely outlet village they actually have a shuttle from paris um, city so they have two pickup, if I'm not mistaken. It's in the east um, of Paris and the west of Paris. You can actually book the tickets from the website itself of Lovely Outlet. I'm gonna put it here in the description um, below. They do have half day trip and they also do have a full day trip. So you get options to choose between those. All right, moving on. This Gucci baby. This is actually one of my favorites in this purchase because I feel like I really scored it in a good price. Um, and also the design is um, not that usual that you may see in the boutiques. And um, yeah, let's open it. You have a lot of sneakers available in the outlet. I mean, I, I think it's all around outlets all over the world, but um, this design, this is the first time that I saw this in um, Gucci outlet and I'm so lucky to really really have this. I've been looking for this sneaker for a long time. So guys, even if you purchase in an outlet, you'll get it like in full set still. So I got this uh, paper bag still, the box, the shoes with the dust bags also. Yeah, it comes in two dust bags still. There you go. It's super nice because um, it has this Gucci vibes, you know what I mean? <laughs> it has this Gucci vibes and plus, um, this is the edition where Gucci released this not fake um, lineup. So as you can see, I think I got it like around um, 350 euros, 350 euros. Usually like in a store price, you will get this around 500 um, to 600 euros. But yeah, so it's like half of the price that I got it and um, plus less the tax refund. So it's really a good deal. Anyway, this Louis Vuitton um, boxes are actually chocolates. I went to this um, Louis Vuitton 
um, dream shop so they actually have been selling there as a trial some chocolates and they also have a cafe so you might want to visit that one too I'll put it also in the description down below. So let's open up this next baby. So we have a Prada over here. This is also one of my favorites. I think that this is one of the best purchases that I ever had in my life. I mean, um, I don't also have this kind of style yet, but that's why when I saw it, I actually didn't hesitate to purchase it. And this is also my um, first Prada shoes. So yeah, I already revealed it. Super duper beautiful, guys. I'm telling you, I've been eyeing for the Chanel shoes for a long time. And when I saw this, I was like, okay, I'm gonna buy this. I'm gonna buy this first before that Chanel shoes. Because it's like almost look alike to each other. It's very classy. It's, um, it's like timeless. It's very simple but sophisticated. Um, it's really, really nice. It's so beautiful. And it matches to any outfit that you're gonna wear. I've got this um, Prada Ballerine shoes in um, beige. Is it beige or brown? I'm not sure. So it's two-tone. It's black and brown, as you can see. Or nude. Can I say nude? Yeah. It's super duper beautiful. It's really, really nice. Um, I'm actually obsessed. I mean, I want to get a new one again. I want to get the full black. I got it for 350 euros in store, if you will. Um, if you will search it because I search it first before I purchase so when I search it they're selling it in store for around um, 600 euros 600 to 700 euros actually so I got it only for 350 and less the tax refund again so we've got a good deal in here So my suggestion to you guys, if you want to go to Lovely Outlet, you might want to go early, as early as you can. Take the 9 a.m. Um, shuttle so that there's not much people yet in there and you're not going to spend so much time falling in the line. Let's move on to our last bag purchase, the most expensive bag that I purchased in this trip because um, basically it's not on sale. <laughs> it's not on sale, but um, it's still much cheaper because it's way too cheaper than here in Dubai. Though I really think twice, thrice before I get this bag. And um, that is, ta-da! I got this um, Saint Laurent bag that I've been eyeing for a long time. Though I'm also a fan of crossbody bags and I'm a fan of black and gold. I think you already have an idea which bag I got in here. The bag that I was looking for is a bag where I can take with me during my trips, not that big, not too small, um, just a medium size also, and it's very handy. So here we go. San Laurent actually have this um, great, great quality of leather with their bags. So that's one of the reasons that I um, like this. the Cassandra envelope um, chain sling bag. The reason why I love this perfect leather um, texture is that it's actually a two-way bag. So let's open it. As you can see, I still didn't remove all the stuff in there. Like this. You can use it as a crossbody. Yeah. The chain is not that long. So it's actually perfect for my um, height. I'm 5'3 feet and it's super perfect on me. And you can open it easily, get your things inside. Yeah, super duper nice. And it matches any outfit also. As you can see, it's just so classy. So it also has um, different compartments. It has two in here plus there's a zipper compartment. Also, it has a card holder, card holder compartments. So you can really put a lot of your stuff in here and it's perfect for um, traveling, also perfect for like formal events. You can also use this in this way, 
just like a medium handbag. This is another way of using this bag. This is one of my favorite ways. You can actually use it as a shoulder bag. So if you have any formal events, as you can see, it's gonna be really nice. To me, it's really a good deal because um, it's way too cheaper to buy it from Paris than here in Dubai. And also at the same time, it's multi-purpose in three ways. So you can shorten this strap more, just like what I showed you earlier. And at the same time, you can use it as a crossbody. Yeah. It is a wrap and um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys learned something from this. If you guys want me to make another video for the tax refund process, uh, feel free to comment it down below. The tax refund process now in Europe is way, way too simpler and easier than the process before. And also another thing, very, very important. So to everyone who's shopping in Europe, don't forget to go first to the tax refund machine or to the tax office, customs tax office, and um, get your tax refund done first before checking in. Because um, the moment that you check in, you can't actually do your tax refund anymore. You can't process it. Because um, the, the customs tax officer would actually look for the items that you purchase. So you might want to take your luggage with you or all the stuff that you purchase before checking in so that you could get your tax refund done. And go to the airport as early as you can because who knows, in Europe there's a lot of, um, <laughs> there's a lot of like uh, changes in the, the timing of the customs tax. The machine sometimes isn't working. There's a lot of circumstances that um, yeah, we can't avoid and all you have to do is just go over there early as much as you can before you check in. If you guys have any questions, clarifications, and um, any suggestions for the next video, feel free to comment it down below and I'll be